welcome back to Kinga's world. Yes, I do look like a mess. Yes, I do have a giant monster on my face. But hey, it's the last day of my holiday in Poland. And I don't care how I look. Because in 24 hours, I will be home in my own bed doing absolutely nothing for three days before I go back to work. Um, there won't be a video. I can't look at it. Just, let's ignore it. Let's just sit this way. <laughs> um, I was thinking, should I make a video about my New Year's resolutions? <sighs> and I don't know if I want to make one. Um, I was thinking, should I make a video about at the end of the year, like what from my last year's uh, resolutions I actually managed to achieve, but I don't quite know yet if I'm going to make one. Um, one thing I'm definitely going to focus on next year is this channel, because I really enjoyed working on it this last few months, especially. Um, I'm not going to lie, quite a lot of my like new following came from the Income Family Drama videos. Um, but quite a few of these followers are already gone because they just came here for a drama and when I just went back to my usual subjects they're gone but some of them stayed and I thank you for that. I still do get some new followers, some views on my videos so I'm just going to keep going. Um, what I'm going to focus on this um, this year on this channel is me. Definitely. Hey, we, we don't call it King's World for nothing. Um, I'm having a break from the fertility treatment for the next five to eight weeks. Um, don't want to go into detail why right now, but it's um, it's mainly because I'm in Poland right now, so I can't don't have access to the medication I should be taking. So my uh, clinic doctor from the clinic and I decided that I'm gonna have, have a little break, and we're gonna start again in like February maybe. Um, I'm really happy about it because I've spent the last few months just pumping, pumping hormones, injections, tablets and everything else into my body. So I'm actually looking forward to having a few weeks of feeling like myself uh, because this meds really made me feel rubbish. And um, I'm going to spend the next few weeks focusing on my weight because I've gained shit loads of weight in the last few months. Uh, it's partly because of the meds, partly because I didn't have any energy to exercise after taking them. All I was doing is coming home and sleeping, just feeling like rubbish. But also because I haven't been moving much, I haven't been running for months. So I kind of use meds as excuse a little bit, but I've also been quite lazy. Um, so I've gained quite a lot of weight and now I'm at this point when there is a chance that this medication is not going to work and we're going to have to go through IVF. And I know I have to lose all this extra weight that I've just gained. I have to lose it to be able to go through IVF. Um, it took me over two years to, get, to go to the weight that I was in May. And uh, I went from size 20 to size 14 and I was so happy. It was hard work, it was lots of exercise and diet and looking after myself. And then since July when I started all the treatment, it just all went downhill. Um, and I need to refocus because I've gained half of the weight that I've lost and actually more than half. Um, I've gained it all back and I need to focus now on losing it again because I'm really struggling looking at myself in my clothes, looking at myself in the mirror. I've seen the pictures that we took here in Poland and I, I really don't like what I see. And, um, and I know that if it wasn't for the treatment, I wouldn't be that bothered by the weight. But because I know I have to be at certain weight, um, I need to focus on it. So there's a goal to go back and from Saturday to Saturday started exercising again and um, and just trying to lose this weight. I'm planning to maybe start walking back home from work. So taking the bus to work in the morning and then walking back home. It's about an hour. So I'm thinking even on the days when I can't exercise, uh, like go for a run or something, I could just walk home for an hour. And it takes me an hour. But that's the plan. Um... I think I'm going to be quiet about the fertility things for the next month or so because I say there will be nothing happening uh, on this, like, in our journey, so there'll be nothing to put on this channel. So there will be videos about uh, my fertility struggles. Um, so there will be videos about my weight loss, about my diet, because I'm definitely going back to keto. I think I'm going to start with egg fast and just 
just give myself back because that was a carb overload for next two for next for last two months. I need to spend the next two months cleaning my body and inside. Um, what else am I planning for 2019? Um, definitely started with hair. And this one is not too crazy, but if I were you, I would be expecting loads of crazy hair colors, hairstyles coming from me in 2019. And I'll be making videos because everyone likes seeing girl destroying her hair. <laughs> Why not? Um, I'll be... I have some ideas. I don't want to put all of them out, but I have some ideas. But if you've been watching me for a while and you know what Kinga's World is all about, and you have any suggestions, any videos you want me to make, any Q and A, any story times, anything that you want to know about me or my life or how Kinga's World become Kinga's World, feel free to put it in the comment section or. Send me a message on Instagram. Lots of people sort of put in comments under my videos. Just message me on Instagram. My Instagram is simply underscore Kinga. You can find me there. The account is not private or anything. So you can follow me there. So yeah, I'm promising. I've now promised that before, but then life happened. Fertility meds happened and me being lazy happened. So I wasn't really putting the uh, content as much as I wanted to. I'm not quite happy. I think I put like three or four videos in December. So that's actually quite good for me. I'm aiming for one video a week. Is it going to happen? I don't know. But I'm planning to have at least one video a week in 2019. Let's see how it goes. So yeah, once again, as usual, thanks for watching. Thanks for being in Kinga's world. Thanks for all your comments and the love I got from you. Uh, 2018 was so much easier because of the internet friends I found through this YouTube channel and Instagram. And... Um, it's a bit late now because it's the 3rd of January, but Happy New Year, guys. I wish you all the best this year. Thanks for watching. You know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. Hate comment too. Come on. I didn't have Hater of the Week for months now. Come on. I kind of miss that. But thanks for being here. Thanks for being part of Kinga's world. And thanks for watching. Um, as I say, having thousands of views per video was was great but having like 20 or 50 views in a way that is the same people coming back again and again watching these videos commenting messaging and interacting meant the world to me so thanks guys and i see you hopefully next week